good morning to all so today we are going to see about so how to interface arduino with the matlab zoom link so first you have to connect arduino to pc or laptop using usb so after connecting first you have to check the com port for arduino so we have to check the com port just to go to this pc and right click and go to manage so after go to computer management just you have to click uh, device manager and then uh, click ports see that so this is the com port for uh, arduino connected with the laptop just you have to note down that uh, com port number so next go to matlab and then you have to click simlink library so in simlink library you have some option so nothing but simlink support package for arduino hardware see that so this is a package for connecting arduino with matlab just you have to click common so this is a basic peripherals available in the arduino simlink block so now just you have to connect that mean uh, you got to blink the led so for that just you go to choose uh, digital out and right, right click and add black to model and detail so after that this model going to be added sorry just you got to add this model so this will be placed in the simlink environment so you not to blink the led see one source so for that just to go to source and then click pulse generate and then add this block in the simlink environment after that just you got to connect this pulse generator with the digital output simlink block so next to process you got to specify the amplitude and frequency otherwise called time period for blinking led so for that just you go to place amplitude equal to 1 1 means the output will be 5 volt 0 means output will be 0 volt so i am going to blink the led with 2 second and with 50 percentage due to sec that mean the led going to be on for 1 second and off for One second, so totally two seconds. So and then you go to click OK. So next you go to configure the pin number, uh, digital out pin number. So for that, just you go to Arduino board. so here i am connected that uh, uh, led in a uh, digital pin h okay so i am going to change the digital pin number is 8 and then okay and then you need to configure So 
simulink model so for that you go to tools and go to hardware board parameters so after clicking that option button so there will be another pop up so here you have to choose Arduino board so here I am using Eno board so I am going to click Arduino Eno so and then you have to configure the com port of the Arduino wait for some time we are going to update the hardware next you go to click the boot connection so in boot connection we can set com port automatically or manually so normally you have to use manually set the com port so already is com port number is one but in this example the com port number is five just to go to change the com port number and then apply and then press ok so source and pin numbers is allocated for Arduino board so simulink mo model is configured next you go to download this model into the Arduino board so for that go to this link nothing but a deploy to hardware just to go to click this one so after clicking this button so matlab is convert that simulink model into hexadecimal form of the Arduino hardware so this is compiler so this convert that uh, actual simulink model into hex code supported for the Arduino so wait for some time ok so binary outputs are generated successfully so build process completed successfully so this is usage of program and data memory so 12 percentage of program memory is used in the Arduino and 12.1 percentage of data memory is used in the Arduino so now see the output of the LED so it will glow for one second and half for one second so next time I going to change the duty cycle so you can see the variation of the blinking so I am going to change the duty cycle so already I have fixed that duty cycle is 50 percentage now I am going to fix the duty cycle is 10 percentage and then once again I am going to uh, down, uh, download in the Arduino the same compiling and downloading processes carry on in the MATLAB with the Arduino After downloading, see the variation in the LED. So, building process completed. Now, see the variation. See that variation. That means uh, 10 percent duty cycle. So, LED will be on for only 0.2 seconds. The remaining time will be in off condition. So simple example doubling the LED in Arduino by using MATLAB support package.
தேங்க்யூ